Yo, what's up ladies and gentlemen, Nelly here. Welcome back to another video. And in today's video, I would like to talk about something and also practice. Because as you can see from the bottom right, I'm on keyboard and mouse now. Right, I think I'm going to switch to keyboard and mouse. and I don't think I'm going to. I'm going to switch to keyboard and mouse. Because I feel like I've hit my, uh, not my peak on controller, but like I just can't do as much on controller. I've been playing controller the entire time I've ever played Fortnite. I've played on controller in three different ways I played on controller. I played uh, regular, so like, let me grab my controller. So when I very first started playing Fortnite when I was a little kid, like when I was 12 or whatever, I played like this, right? Then after I switched to an elite controller, so I had paddles on the back, so I would use the paddles and keep and not press any of these. And then most recently I was playing claw. So it's basically the paddles, but my pointer finger is doing everything. Is doing what my four fingers back here would do. And I feel like playing like that, I just, I can't, I get locked up sometimes because it's one finger doing everything. So sometimes I press it at the wrong time. Sometimes it doesn't get to a button fast enough. Like it's just as fast as my pointer finger can go because that's the only finger doing anything. But even with the paddles... The only issue I fix with the pedal, I'm just, I'm not fast on controller, like, hold on. Let's just, like, show my building. So, like, when I'm building a controller, it, like, building a controller feels so much more natural. But, like, it's that edit right there, right? How I fucked it up. I feel like that's, like, the downfall of me on controller, especially playing claw on controller. Is like, I'm good, right? I can do all this shit. But, like, in terms of, like, consistently doing all of it is hard because you fuck up a lot especially in high pressure moments where you have to also think about shooting and like even right now my finger is hurting while i'm doing all this because here hold on i want to like show hold on wait hold on so like my pointer finger is doing everything i fucked up that but you see how my pointer finger is like the one doing fucking everything when I'm moving around and shit? It hurts bad. It hurts the tendon. It hurts my wrist. Oh, the lighting's horrible. My bad. I was about to say, I just look so white when I lifted up my arm. I need to plug my fucking lamp in, dude. Jesus. We have no lighting. I'm not actually as white. I'm, I'm pretty fucking white, but not that white, okay? All right, now I'm on the keyboard and the mouse. So, hold on. See, like, I'll fuck up my bills like that, I, but I need to get good at this shit. I've only played a little bit on keyboard and mouse. So, like, I mess up my building because my timing with my space bar is off. But in terms of, like, just all the other shit, like, I can just do it so much easier. Fuck. It's going to take time. Like, I'm not going to be as good on controller. I mean, as good on keyboard and mouse as I am on controller. But I can't do all this shit. I can't box fight how I can. That's what I mean, like... I feel like, like, and then, like, I can mess up that edit quite easily. And it's just kind of my hands just feel like they're being fucking abused the entire time I'm playing. Like, it's kind of hard to play. Like that, right? Like that shit. You see how smooth that shit was? Like, even... Oh, I fucked up that edit. But it's just, like, shit like that. Like, I, I feel like I can get so much more consistent. Because I have very good aim, right? Because I used to play a lot of Valorant. I, like, I have good-ass aim. You know, like, I'm going to be a bot. Like, I know for a fact. Like, today, I'm going to be a bot. Tomorrow, I'll probably be a bot. But on Monday, I'll be average. Then on Tuesday, I'll be a little bit above average. Then on Wednesday, I'll be pretty good. Like, in terms of, like, just potential of fighting, especially in fighting, keyboard and mouse is so much better. I think I'd be more confident on keyboard and mouse right now than I would be on controller right now. Actually, nah, that's cap. That, that's me That's me coping with how bad I am at keyboard and mouse. I played controller claw for two weeks. And you guys can see the level I'm at by looking at the previous videos. And how, like, I improved. Because I did improve greatly and I improved pretty quick. That's what I'm hoping to happen with the keyboard and mouse. Like, if I play keyboard and mouse for two weeks and I still feel like I'm just a bot and, like, I can't. I'm fucking up that stare at it more on fucking keyboard and mouse than I was on controller. Oh my god. There we go. Like, if I play for like a week and I feel like I'm a bot. Like, if by this time wins, uh, not Wednesday. I'm fucking, I'm faded. If by this time Saturday, I don't feel like I'm at, like, at least, like, pretty decent. 
If I don't feel like I could win a lot of fights I get into, then... Like, if I can't even have, like, one good game in the ranked, then I'll probably just switch back to controller, but... It's just, that shit is so much... It's just so much easier. Because on controller, this is what I'm saying. Like, even if I had paddles on controller, I would have to hit Y, perfectly do that, then hit Y again and hit LT, right? Because that's my reset. Like that. Hold on, I'm fucking up so much. Like that. But I still, like, mess it up because of the timing of everything. You don't worry about that on keyboard and mouse. That's why, like, I like it. I'm liking it more. Because this hand is, like, assigned to controlling everything else. Then the mouse hand is literally just reset and aiming. That's all I have to worry about on this hand. So these fingers are activating the edits and everything on my keyboard. And then this is just controlling my aim and everything. So it's like I have a whole ass arm dedicated to my aim. Like that's fucking beautiful, bro. If you're on controller, right, you get bailed out with aim assist with like in terms of like your aim. I didn't even mean to throw that up. In terms of like your aim, you get bailed out with aim assist. That's very true. But in terms of like like actual building skill on controller, bro, you have to be so fucking consistent for it to even mimic a fucking keyboard and mouse player. Like, I don't like, like, bro, the way I want to play, right? Like, you have in your head, like, how you want your play style to be, right? The way I want to play every day is like a fucking keyboard and mouse player. And on controller, you just can't do that shit, bro. Like, I want to be able to confidently do all this. And on controller, I feel like I will never... And that could just be, like, a mental block that I have. That I feel like on controller, I just can't do it. But I really don't think I can on controller. Like, I just feel like I will... Like, I... I feel like no matter how good I got on controller, I will never be as good as I would be on keyboard and mouse. If that makes sense, bro. It's just, I feel like just keyboard and mouse, bro. Keyboard and mouse has so much more potential in doing things. Like, in just having more access to things. I feel like on controller, I'm personally restricted. My fucking gun when you shoot, dude. Oh my god, let's go. That's what I'm saying. Like, I can't do that on fucking controller, bro. Um, I'm gonna keep playing these. I'm gonna get good at keyboard and mouse. And yeah, I'll give you guys a status update in the next couple days how good I am. Yeah, thank you guys for watching. Wish me luck, and I hope you guys have a great day.